Namaste to one and all. Welcome to my channel. Today's topic is class 10 dams which comes under geography, CBSE. Here, on map, we can learn dams from north to south. According to the map listing given by the CBSE syllabus, there are eight dams here to focus on. First one is Salal Dam. So I am uh, focusing from north to south. First, uh, Salal Dam, which is on Chenab River. It is in Jammu and Kashmir Union Territory. Then move a little more. Then you are reaching Bakranangal uh, Project, Bakranangal Dam, which is on Sutlej River. Little more, the Bias River also comes. Sutlej River and Bias, that were written in the textbook. So Bakranangal in Sutlej that comes under Himachal Pradesh. So Jammu and Kashmir, then comes the Himachal Pradesh. Then move little more, little more I went in that map. <laughs> that only is, that is Tehri Dam, which is on Bhagiradi River. And uh, it is uh, in Uttarakhand. So Jammu Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand. So three dams you, have, you came across. Then move further, you are reaching Rajasthan. There, Rana Pradhava Sagar, that is Chambal River, Chambar. Really, here we can see the tributaries, that is Yamuna, Genga, both are intersecting here, that is the Allahabad, and uh, here Gagara, Gangtag, Koshi, Chambal, is Koshi comes then Chambal, is this Chambal River, this Chambal, on this Chambal comes uh, Rana Pradhava Sagar, then move to the Gujarat. You will come across Sardar Sarovar Dam. And that is on Narmada River. Uh, this Rana Pradhava Sagar on Chambal River. And Sardar Sarovar Dam in, on Narmada River. And while you move to the eastern coast, you will get uh, Hirakud. You can see Hirakud Dam. And uh, Hirakud Dam is on Mahanadi. Mahanadi and this Mahanadi is in Odisha. So Hirakut in Odisha. Then move south again. You will reach Telangana, the border of Telangana and other place. There comes the Nagarjuna Sagar Dam that is on Krishna. Nagarjuna Sagar Dam on Krishna. Again move further. You are reaching Karnataka. In Karnataka, you can see the Tungabhadra Dam, which is constructed on Tungabhadra River itself. So, only by drawing the river, only by knowing the river, it is difficult for you. So, that is why state-wise also you go through. This way, Salal, Chambal in Jammu and Kashmir, Bakranangal on Satlaj River, that is Himachal Pradesh, then Tehri Dam, Is Tehri Dam is in Bhagiradi River on Uttarakhand. Yes, I have I have written it in corresponding states where it is. Is Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand. This is Uttarakhand. Then Rana Pradhava Sagar Dam in Rajasthan. That is on Chambal River. Yes, further you move south, you are reaching Sardar Sarovar Dam. Narmada River in Gujarat. Just this map is for understanding which state it is located. Then you move to the eastern coast that is Odisha. That is a Hirakunda. Further you move. Yes, this is Andhra Pradesh and this is Telangana, new state. And uh, latest states, one of the states that is a, that is a Nagarjuna Sagar Dam on Krishna River. That is in Telangana. That is in Telangana. Then move further to the south. You are reaching Tungabhadra River. That is in Karnataka on Tungabhadra River. I hope you understood. There is an easy way method of learning. Dams which are enlisted in this uh, syllabus of class 10. These are the eight names of the dams and their states. 
and uh, I have done a full map regarding the map that you can go through. It's majority of them said it is useful. So if you are not seen, please search and find out. Thank you all.